Welcome to another episode of Aaliyah's World of Delusion. Why is Target not having this stuff on sale is what I want to know. Tarjay, call me. Alright y'all, we are ready. My friend is so happy. Hey y'all, welcome and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Aaliyah Aria if you are new here and I make videos about lifestyle, beauty, and travel content. So if that's something that you like, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below. Today's Tuesday. It is rodeo day, y'all. It's March 12th. We have already been on the go this morning. We had a visit this morning. Uh, we have been cleaning up. We have been editing and uploading. And now we are about to head to the vet. Rocco has an appointment for 1.30. I gave him <clears throat> these sedatives. Hold on, let me have her name. I gave him these sedatives earlier. It's called Trazodone. If you ask me, I don't think he's calm. He's a calm dog. Let me say that. He's a calm dog. But I don't think he's any calmer. You know what I'm saying? So we're crossing our fingers. He did not have a good day. Yesterday when I tried to take him, if you want more details, make sure you go see the last vlog to see what happened with my baby doggy. Um, but basically, he needs to get his anal glands expressed, okay? Um, I'm about to eat a quick lunch, brunch, as I take him to the vet. And y'all, we're waiting on our Amazon order, okay? We're waiting on some boots and we're waiting on some... A hat. I ordered two hats. The boots are like nine stops away. I have no clue where the hats are. The goal is to be at the rodeo at 7.30. So, we're praying. Okay? If I have to go to Boot Barn or somewhere, I will to get a hat because I got brown boots. I just need a hat. So, I know the Amazon order is going to make it though. So, yeah. Anyway, y'all, let's go to the bed. Hopefully, they can release me. So, I'm about to put on some tennis shoes just in case I want to take a walk um, while I wait for Rocco. So, yeah. At the bed, he did not want to go back, but he's back there. And I hope they can get it done for him today. It's 2 o'clock, y'all. The boots made it. So, now we just wait on the hat. On second time, that ain't the way to go. I gotta give a game proper. Spit it so she get it. There she is, I gotta stop her. All right, y'all. We're leaving. He cried again, but we did good. And I just got him some treats. Back in the car. And boy, did we have a trip. Okay, so they had to bribe Rocco with treats. Um, he ended up allowing them to do it. Um, and just as, it, just as I expected, they said that his glands were extremely full. Um, so they were able to get him out. She did let me know that the uh, that his glands are set up differently from other dogs. Like his glands are deeper inside, is what she said. Um, sorry if that's TMI, but that's why it hurts him so bad. So I gotta order him some vitamins from Amazon. So I'll do that today when I get back home. Uh, we just came from. The doggy store like a little doggy cookie store cookie and grooming store and i got him two treats but having to endure all that pain so he got this cute little saint patrick's day beer looking cookie and then i got him another cookie that says you're so fetch so i'm gonna give him this cookie right now he probably gonna make a mess but my car already dirty one cookie daddy for dealing with all that pain mommy no Mommy, no. I gotta get this lash pillow out of here today. It's your cookie, Daddy. Mm. 
He don't want to eat it. I got to go to H-E-B and get some toothpaste. So that's what we about to do. I want to try to see a client today. I think I told y'all my boots came. So we're going to go home too. Try on those boots. So now we just wait for the hat. And hopefully it go ahead and go ahead and come on now. So all I got to do is get ready. Once I see my clients today. Yeah. But we came back from H-E-B. I got some Sensodyne Pro Nammel. I got a small one. They had a coupon for the one pack. Um, $1 off. So this was $5. Um, I haven't been to Sam since uh, January. So it's about time for me to make the Sam trip. <clears throat> So, we'll be doing that soon. Probably Friday in the daytime. Because my calendar is already pretty booked. Oh my God, I'm ripping this package open and I haven't showed y'all a thing. So, this was on my Sephora VIB wish list was to get some Zoat soap. And randomly, I was in H-E-B looking for some um, sanitizer because I keep forgetting and I just forgot again. I keep forgetting to get my car germ mix out of the car. So, I might just need to take that big old germ mix with me outside and just refill it. Because I'm about to get ready to go make a visit. Okay, I know. I know good and doggone well. I don't need to be making no visit when I got to do my makeup. I don't even know what I'm wearing to the uh, concert tonight. I am just playing with fire. But when it comes to the money... I'm going where it resides, okay? Where the money reside, where the money reside. That's where you're gonna find me at, so. It ain't nothing but a quick 30 minutes. So I'm gonna go get my Q coin for my 30 minute visit today. I was gonna cancel, but it's kinda like, what's the point? Like, I feel like I wanna do it today, so I'm gonna do it today. If that puts me a little bit behind for later, as far as it comes to like filming content, I'm cool with that because I know, I know me. I'm not gonna wanna make this session up. So you know what I'ma do? I'ma go ahead and do my therapy today. But before we go, we're gonna run downstairs, get the boots, and we're about to clean our makeup brushes really quickly. Y'all, why did I know how thick this freaking Zolt soap is? Like, let's be FFR. And one thing that I don't hear the girls talking about is how they store this. How y'all be storing this Zolt soap, babes? Let me know. All right, we're about to get it started. I don't know. Should I do this in the sink or what? I feel like as long as I get to my client by uh, 3.45, I am good to go. This is messy. Cleaning makeup brushes is so freaking messy, y'all. And I've been seeing Chelsea use this dope soap. So, I was like, you know what? Let me give it a try. And moments like this. One of my friends sent me a blow dryer one time. Like for my makeup brushes. This would be a good time for me to use it. For me to have it, rather. I didn't show y'all the before of this, but... Two swipes, and this is clean. Don't play with it. Here's the next one. This is a foundation brush. I also feel like this might be why my face is breaking out too, because my brushes have been used several times. And I want a smooth application tonight. So I'm trying to clean my brushes to the best of my ability. I ain't gonna clean them all the way, all the way, because I don't want them to be soaking wet for tonight. Since I ain't got nowhere to dry them, so. This is the after of this, um, of this one. You can still see a little bit of residue on there, but it's not bad. So let's do the rest. We don't have that many more, but this is what we're gonna do. Alright y'all, Zolt Soap for the win. We got the brushes clean. 
semi clean at least i'm about to go put another paper towel on top of this i'm trying to like flatten them out so they could be as dry as possible when it's time for me to do my makeup y'all lord i hope i ain't making no bad decision i might need to go sit them on the porch so they can have like an hour and a half to dry The books are here. The books are here. Ah! I hope they look just like they do on Amazon. Of course, we got a nosy bystander here. Okay, they straight. These are more for comfort. And when I put them on, they're going to look cute. Let's try them on. Yeah. Y'all, they are so comfortable. When I think about you, I think about giving myself to you. Cause you know I want you, baby. I will do anything. I'm messing up. Everything. So I'm coming. We gonna try to make these look cute cause they too comfortable. I asked Alexa how long it's gonna take my brushes to get dry. She says six to eight hours. Welcome to another episode of Aaliyah's World of Delusion. Because why would I wash them brushes when I need to use them in an hour? And I don't know if I have some more. So I might have to go to Ulta probably. I don't know. We're gonna figure it out. We're gonna figure it out. I'm not about to stress. I'm also kind of thinking about my hat. It's not here yet. I don't know how many stops away it is. So we might have to go get a hat. Back home in the nick of time, baby. And look what came. Y'all, I'm gonna look like a real cowgirl. I feel like last year I was looking like cute rodeo girl i'm just here to show up for a good time but this time girl is giving very much i'm about to load up the horses oh uh-uh why is this head like that girl what have i done oh uh-uh girl i don't like this head exaggerating let's see I probably could finish it's gonna have to work I also got some glasses I don't know what the look is going for today because I got glasses and everything child and these like the vintage Chanel's so are they gonna look cute with the hat? Let's see. Girl, I look like somebody ain't see at the mud ride. And I don't know how I feel about that. It's giving now. But I'm gonna have to wear it, y'all. Girl, I'm not wearing these glasses. Now with some hearts on the side like that, I can't do it. I refuse to play. All right, let me quickly show y'all what I got from Ulta since I decided to be a genius and wash my brushes. 
Yeah, I don't know what be going through my mind. Clearly nothing, okay? Clearly I'm being an airhead today, which is not good. It's not a good look, sis. It's not a good look. But from Ulta, I got some more Power Grip Primer, some more Real Technique brushes. So now I have two sets of these. Concealer brush because that Real Techniques pack don't come with it. And I got Fortune Cookie as a topper. And I got a pencil sharpener for my lip liners. We're about to go get ready. We showered earlier today. So we're going to freshen up, do our makeup. <clears throat> We're gonna do our edges first and then our makeup. So we won't be doing much talking until we get ready, y'all. So I'll meet y'all in the next couple clips. All right, y'all, we are ready. Taloya is waiting for me. I am not in love with my outfit, but I think it's cute though to say it's last minute. Hold on, I don't know how much y'all gonna be able to see. <laughs> It's getting a real cowgirl, honestly, and I love it. So, my house is a mess. I'm not gonna hold you down, babe. Like, I just ran through this house tearing it to pieces, okay? But this is the outfit. It's cute, though. I think it's such a cute last minute outfit. Like, yeah, she's giving. All right, y'all, I'm fixing a last minute drink. So, I got tequila and cranberry juice. And my Stanley cup that I got for Francis. That I ain't got no real lid for real. Ooh, I'm gonna have to pull some of that out. We about to go, y'all. I will see y'all on the iPhone. Peace. We made it, y'all. We gotta wait on the next transportation to come. Sixteen carriages driving away while I watch them ride with my dreams away. Summer sunset on a holy night on a long back road on a tears I fight. Seventeen carriages driving away while I watch them ride with my dreams away to the summer sunset. <laughs>
completely okay i got a couple things to return to amazon yeah i bought some grills let me show this to y'all and i really wanted them to work but girl why did i cut my gums like i, I put them in my mouth i didn't even change the battery <laughs> i put them in my mouth before leaving one of them got stuck girl and i started bleeding they are so cute though I really got to get some grill. I want a grill. Either just the lining of my teeth or just a couple of, uh, just a couple with like just the shape of my teeth. Not a full grill, y'all. Zombie alarmed, okay? But the concert was good, y'all. We got Drake, okay? And me and my girl didn't even pay that much for tickets. Even though she said her brother was able to get his tickets for less than what we paid. We paid $200. And we got our tickets before uh, the hype. Before we found out Drake was coming. So, um, I think we paid a really good price for our tickets. I think we paid a little bit more than what we paid last year. And that's cool because we got Drake this time, y'all. Drake is a top dog artist, okay? Can't be mad at it. Can't be mad at the price at all. All right, y'all, we got a new battery in, and my babe called me, so we talking on the phone to him, but I also want to tell y'all about my night. The night was really cool. The night was really fun. In comparison to last year, I would say this year's concert was um, shorter. I feel like Mantalori didn't get there until 9 last year. We got there like 8.30 this year, um, and the concert ended at... 11:30. Yeah. So it was it was short. It was a short concert. Uh but they had E40, EVE, Eve. <laughs> Why did I spell her name like I'm rapping or something? We had Drake, we had Rick Ross, Ricky Rose, Stand on Bidney. Okay. <laughs> Y'all, I put on my story. I'm gonna have to uh pop it up on the screen here. Tia Kemp, Auntie, Auntie. Stand no business. Okay? I love her. She's so funny. But uh who else was there? If I'm missing somebody, I'll pop their names up on the screen. Oh, Yin Yang Twins was there. I saw a lot of people complaining about the lineup. To me, the lineup was pretty good. It was pretty decent. It's not always about like having Houston artists. And I could be biased because I'm not a huge Ooh, that stuff's strong. <coughs> vampire blood that's strong child let me add it to my purse but um to me it's not always about having all houston artists all the time because it's not that many houston artists if we if we really having a conversation that's like well known don't get me wrong i love houston rap houston music 
Houston artists I love but a lot of them are not that well known like Ken the Man is my girl I love a, I love a rap girl okay Ken the Man is my girl I think she would do really good at the show but the truth of the matter is a lot of people don't know her so yeah um the concert was good I rated 10 out of 10 stars I was up on my feet dancing the whole night he had the Mexican OT which is a Mexican rapper it was good. It was a good time. I'm happy Saloya was like, girl, let's get these tickets. I ain't even know the lineup until tonight. <laughs> okay? I love a good time. Know that. Know that. Okay? Last minute outfit, eight. It came together so good. And y'all, I'm pretty sure I told y'all this hat from Amazon. I love it because it's versatile. So I'll be able to wear this on the beach. I could wear this to the beach. I could wear this to the rodeo. The rodeo leaves Houston on Sunday, March 17th. I supposed to be going back with one of my friends to do something special. So y'all stay tuned for that. Um, what else was I going to say? I can't remember what else I was gonna say other than the house is a mess. And I'm about to clean it up. It's 1 a.m. I want to work a little bit tomorrow. I am going to work a little bit tomorrow. But I ain't going to sleep with, with this stuff everywhere. Like, I got clothes that I was trying on that I decided not to wear on my bed. Makeup is everywhere. Um, I got to put this lamp up. Not, what is this? This ring light? The ring light needs to be put away. It's just stuff that needs to be put back in its place. And it should take me no more than 10 minutes. I'm about to tell Myron about my night. And then we are going to go shower and then bed. And I will see y'all tomorrow. I might check back in with y'all once we done cleaned up and filmed. So. good morning happy wednesday today we had a super duper slow morning y'all um the cleaner did reach back out to me yesterday i never responded back so i need to see if she's still available she is available this friday at around 3 30. i would prefer a morning time but I understand that I'm reaching out last minute and she has clients on retainer. So I gotta make do with what I can. So we're about to go on a high girl walk. And as I'm walking, I'm gonna text her and see if she still has Friday available. Today is payday. <clears throat> so there is a lot of money left from my last check. Some of that money is going to the cleaner. Okay. Um don't be alarmed. I know y'all saw this outfit in the last vlog. But in the last vlog, I wore it just to um, take the dog to the vet. And I was going to go on a high girl walk. But if you watched the last vlog, then you know how that went. <sighs> y'all, I'm supposed to be taking some time off this week. But I've been working since Monday. Honestly, I, I literally have been working since Monday. Um, I'm going to work today. Today is going to be my last day working. So that way I can have Thursday. Friday, Saturday, Sunday off, and I'll just write a report or two. Uh, maybe later today, I don't know. If I can write those reports today, I can truly have Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday off. That would be amazing. Because um, I do need some time off, y'all. I just always be working. But um, my, job is, my job is easy, so I don't mind it. But sometimes you do need like a true day off. We're about to go get a hot girl walk in. I'm probably only, only gonna do like 30 minutes because I am getting a late start. And I wanna be at the daycare that I need to go to by 2.45. So, I mean, I need to shower, I need to eat, and then head to the daycare. I'm sure I could do it, I just gotta focus. Um, trying to make sure I got everything. I got my water packs, I got my over the ear headphones, I got my Apple headphones, like my AirPods. My, I'm not taking a, a purse or anything because I'm just going for a walk. 
my keys and my phone. That's all I need. And y'all, so uh, let's go. Once entering my bed, had a few dreams about you. I can't tell you what we did. I Man, y'all about to talk about me. It look kind of dark, so let me let the roof back. I need to get a new gummy thing for my car. Y'all about to talk about me because why did both of my clients leave the daycare in their school early today? So I'm sitting outside of this school and I pulled up. I walked to the door. Why my clients sitting in a lobby in a waiting area with their mom? Like, where y'all going? Don't tell me y'all about to leave. They about to leave. So <clears throat> if only I would have came 20 minutes earlier. I can't be mad at nobody but myself because I've really been chilling so hard today and now look it's too bright. Let me move because I'm not particularly ready to go. This man riding a bike hollering and screaming on church property. Hollering and screaming at nobody. Okay. Um <clears throat> But y'all, I can't be mad at nobody but myself because, like I said, if I would have came a little bit earlier, I would have been okay to still see my client. So, tomorrow I got plans to go to the rodeo at 4. So, I don't know if it's going to be, if I'm going to be able to um, see my 4 o'clock. So, basically, I'm just creating extra work for myself because I could have seen both of the clients today and been done working for the week. But because I want to chill, now I got to see one client tomorrow. And then I don't know if I'll be able to see this client early because he's in actual school. <clears throat> I have on my seatbelt, y'all know that thing be ringing for the back seat. But yeah, I don't know. I'm going to do better. I promise I am. Cause this is ridiculous but now we're on the way to target like i'm mad but i ain't too too mad okay i want to see my client and make that coin but this really my off week so if i miss them i miss them but i don't want to miss them <laughs> i wanted to go to a liquidation store today but i don't think i probably could just roll by just to see you know what they got do I like it and stuff like that but <clears throat> I kind of want to just order my stuff offline and just call it a day because what I'm going to the liquidation store for is a computer desk chair um, but I already got some chairs pulled up like from Wayfair Walmart and all those stores so I could just order one from there and call it a day I'm scrolling on Instagram Look, look at mine driving the boat. He got this music loud, so I might have to mute it. Oh, snap. Y'all, he got to avoid them damn bridges, baby. Let me tell you something. That's scary. Yeah, we in Target. I saw Courtney with this beige jumpsuit on. I'm about to get both and try them on and see which one I like best. I picked up a 14 in the green. I need a 14 in this cream, but they ain't have it. I got a 17. So I'm going to try on both of these and see which one. Fits. That's crazy because online it says they have a 16 and a 14. But I don't see it. I'm going to check by the dressing room though. I think these are a part of the two-piece sets I be seeing people wear on TikTok. I don't think I'm too crazy about these stripes. And they look short. Wait a minute now. They on clearance. So we probably can do a little something with them for the radio. They ain't got no XL. Just a 2X. And it's purple. They got it in the black, but I don't like this black too much. I could try them on though. $23. I got a lot of little cute tennis skirts. I like this white one. And this pink one too. 
Okay, this home section looks so freaking nice. What is this? Oh, a doorstop? This is nice. For a bathroom. So, by my entryway, I'm gonna put some pictures of me and Mary. And I'm thinking about doing a single picture. Or maybe I could do two smaller pictures. What y'all think? I love how this one has black and gold, but the four by six is just way too small. This is so cute. <laughs> The top is kind of big, but y'all know I'm two different sizes, so I would just have to like finesse it. But it's cute. Oh my god. $70 later, we are out the store. I only got three things, y'all. Um, I needed some no-show socks bad, okay? I've been wearing mixed match socks, and they ain't even no-show, girl. It's just been real ghetto. But we are about to go on a little solo day, solo dinner date. I'm hungry. And what should we eat? Where that little germix? I think I need to go buy some little small germix because... I still ain't refill my car Germex. I ended up getting the cream jumpsuit, y'all. I did a story post. I don't know why I be doing it. I guess for engagement. Because I already be having my mind made up. The green is cute, but I got that mint green two-piece set. So, I was like, you know what? Let me get white. I don't have nothing cream. So, I got it. All I need is some um i want some i might need to get that kurt geiger like colorful set because it's gonna be spring it's gonna be summer and i'll get a lot of use out of it it's like uh some colorful sandals and a little cute colorful bag <clears throat> lord the people on my store talking about getting both but where y'all think the money at okay i ain't got money to blow pookies why is target not having this stuff on sale is what i want to know Tarjay, call me. Because y'all ain't got nothing on sale. They got graphic tees, jeans, and um, and something else on sale for 40% off. So I might get a couple graphic tees. But I need clothes, clothes. Not no freaking graphic tees. I got enough tees. I was trying to get <clears throat> a cute workout set or a graphic tee for... Um, to wear to the rodeo tomorrow because i want to be chill and comfortable but they didn't have the ones that i wanted in store i think i added one to my cart i'm trying to do, i'm trying to talk to y'all about what i just saw in target and trying to see what i want to eat you know what i'm just gonna order takeout because i don't have my headphones and i really don't like going out to eat without my headphones so Maybe we'll go out to eat. We'll take ourselves on a date. Another day this week. Just not today. Because I ain't got my headphones. I was even in Target like, dang, I need my headphones. Yeah, we just got back home. I'm watching Courtney vlog. She just reminded me. That I need to clean my drawers out. I really do need to get them drawers clean. Look at these tripods sliding down. <laughs> I didn't even put the sauce on there. The gravy. Y'all, I'm so hungry and I still got to walk the dog. I I just need to take a couple bites. But y'all, I forgot to tell y'all. Last night when we was at the concert, girl. Y'all know I was trapped from the iPhone. But please tell me why. My iPhone 13 Pro Max tried to play me. 
talking about I ain't got no room left on the phone to record or take pictures. First of all, baby, I paid for two terabytes on Apple iCloud. Second of all, my phone itself has 500 gigabytes. Why you ain't got no room? A part of the problem is me. I do have like almost 60,000 pictures and videos. Don't talk about me. Don't worry about it. I'm going to clean it out, okay? <laughs> I'm cleaning it out. I'm working on a collaboration with a company who needs to go ahead and respond to me about the details, okay? Because that'll be a way I can get some stuff off my phone. I also have Google Photos, but I just don't trust that. Like, I want my own pictures in my own phone. But let me tell y'all what was taking up so much room on my phone. CapCut. CapCut takes up so much storage and data. I deleted about five videos and that freed up 40 gigabytes. Four zero. Like, yes, I can delete some pictures and stuff and videos, but I can guarantee you the pictures and videos that I'm going to delete won't equal 40 gigabytes. Over time, it might. But just in one day, in, in less than 10 minutes, it won't nearby equal that. Girl, it's crazy. Let me ask y'all this. What do y'all do with y'all pictures and stuff? I am a digital girl. I love all of my stuff to be digital as far as like my memories and stuff. I back up my phone every single night. <clears throat> what do y'all do? What do y'all do? Do y'all delete pictures every every week, every year, every month? I need all my pictures. I got stuff in my phone from 2014. <laughs> oh, child. I don't play about my memories, okay? Hey, y'all. Good morning. Happy Thursday. I think today might be the last day in the vlog. I don't know. Y'all know I'm still trying to work out this um, new upload schedule. I don't have any plans for tomorrow. I actually don't have any weekend plans, so don't really know how I'm going to do this vlog. We'll figure it out. Anyways, happy Thursday. Y'all, we're getting a late start to the day. What's new? Um, the reason why my day is starting late today is because I was up till 3 a.m., which I have been up till 3 a.m. for the past couple of nights. <clears throat> but I'm getting some rest tonight. <laughs> I'm getting some rest tonight okay but today we are going to the carnival at the houston rodeo we're doing something special i'm not sure if i can share it with y'all yet i gotta talk to my friend to see you know how she's planning to do things but yeah i'm excited for tonight we're also having a group phone call tonight i gotta put together some type of visual because um jess and i are sharing some details for our upcoming girls trip in october so yeah, I am excited about that. Okay, girl. I'm in the neighborhood where they have these townhouses at y'all. My car is doing something crazy. And so apparently in this neighborhood, you can either buy or rent these townhouses. So I'm about to take a picture of the sign to see how much they selling it for. Yeah, y'all. So we got the group phone call later on tonight and honestly i might have to do the phone call in the car so we about to see so it would be best if i could put a visual together so that way if i got to share the visual i could do everything from my phone oops so yeah i'm about to go and get uh something to eat and then i'm gonna try to see one more client so that way i can be at home chilling until it's time to go to the rodeo. I picked up an, um, an Alani New. This flavor is called Dream Float. It does taste like a dream sickle ice cream or something. I don't think I really care for it. It's okay, but I prefer my cherry slush. Creature of habit, babes. Y'all already know the deal. I know my car is in horrible condition. I mean, look at the freaking windshield. I'm going through the drive through car wash. Don't tell my daddy, y'all, because he would have a fit. <laughs> y'all know these drive through car washes be leaving those little scratches, so he always be like, don't take that car through there. But I like to let mine take my car to the hand wash because I don't be wanting to sit there and wait. I really need to find a mobile person, honestly. Thank you. 
ratchet. Niggas want me to attack it. Put the hood on, all the time me cash it. Aren't you like Bob Saget? Hey y'all, it's a couple hours later. I have um, put on a little bit of Rihanna's Fenty Skin Tint over my acne spots, which I have a huge bump that is discolored right here as well as in the middle of my forehead. Y'all, I hate these bumps and I don't know what they are coming from. Maybe they're hormonal, I don't know. I'm getting dressed. I have on this shirt that I wore to my cousin's baby shower over the summer. If you watch that vlog, you know that this is a DIY. If you have not watched the vlog, I will link it in the cards up above. Now, this is a Target top <clears throat> that I cut down the middle. And I'm choosing to wear this top because we're doing like a gender reveal. So I am, um, I'm team girl, but since I am the gender keeper, the secret keeper, whatever you want to call it, I wanted to wear something pink and blue. So this is what we came up with. At my cousin's baby shower, I wore pink pants because I was team girl. I kind of think I'm team, I think I'm team girl again, but I don't want to wear the exact same thing. So I'm going to wear these blue pants. Um, I got my cow boy hat out, but... I'm not too sure if I want to wear it. Honestly, like, I could wear it and not match. It's it's the rodeo. It's the carnival. It doesn't matter. Some people will have on rodeo stuff. Some people won't. As for me, I don't know yet. I think I'm going to bring it just in case my friend asked me to um, be in the video. Like, I don't know if I'm going to be in the video or not. So, I'm just going to bring it. <laughs> Um, I'm wearing tennis shoes. I'm not wearing no boots. I would like to get a picture while I'm there, but I don't have to get a picture. So I'm excited. Also, today has been a full day. I got a chance to create a last minute uh, flyer for my group call today for my trip. I'm going to have to try to show y'all before I leave home. I'm thinking about bringing my tripod, y'all, but my tripod is kind of big. Okay, my tote bag might look a little bit better than the Maylia. Hold on, let me go get the Maylia and I'm going to let y'all decide. So here's the brown bag. Yes, I think I'm definitely going to wear my new bag. My tote bag. So let's go ahead and switch out these purses while I tell y'all about my day. I was having a conversation with my homegirl and she was telling me about something that happened at her job. She works at a daycare and she has a kid there who is about to be either already four about to be four or about to be five i can't remember the child is a bottle sucker and they're about to be four or about to be five y'all it's just crazy i'm not a mom so i could tell y'all what i plan on doing when i become a mom until i'm blue in the face however i think that being that we living life right now and we can say how we want things to go until we can't say it no more. When things actually happen, like when you actually have a kid, when you actually get married, the things that you thought that you would do, you, you quickly find out that you're you going to change your mind up a little bit. So I can never say what I really want to do until I'm in that situation. However, I'm going to tell y'all right now that I do plan on having my baby off the bottle by the time they're one or a little bit after one. So being on a bottle at age four or five, However old is crazy. She told me the little child has to suck a bottle to go to sleep. I'm just sharing this message um, to say, if you are a mom and you have young kids, kind of create, kind of start creating independence. It's very important for your child to be independent no matter if they're one, no matter if they're two or three years old. Start fostering independence. Start letting them get dressed by themselves. Start letting them feed themselves get them off the bottle, get them off the pad seat and things like that. Because when you don't do things like that and you send your kids to daycare and to school, it now kind of becomes the job of the daycare or the school to try to win your kid off of the bottle, off of the pad seat, off of basically everything. And that's really not their job. And then in my friend's situation, the parent is kind of like putting pressure on her and the other teachers to get the baby off of the bottle, but it's not really their job. You know, 
Child, it's, it's crazy. Working with kids, you find out a lot. You really do. So, I just wanted to share that with y'all. I'm sure I will be asking y'all for tips when it is my turn to be a mom. Everything nigga no fast I don't care what you knew me in the past tense. I ain't no Julia Styles, this ain't no last dance. We pass it. Wait. Okay, y'all. So this is the picture that we got from Target yesterday. My friend just texted and said they leaving in 10 minutes. So I wanted to show y'all this quickly. Um, because I never got back on the camera yesterday. So this is the picture that I bought to put me and Myron's wedding, silver wedding pictures and our Italian elopement pictures. Oh, ooh, this thing heavy. I didn't want the actual picture to be so big, but Target didn't have a good selection of um, sizes in between this. Oh my God, the, the camera's about to die. But this is where I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put a picture light up here as well. Hold on, let me adjust y'all. It's gonna go right here with the picture light. Um, I like it for this side, but my dilemma is I wanna also put it on this wall as well. This wall over here is a little bit wider. So y'all, the battery died. This camera's battery dies so quick, but I'm also thinking about putting one on this wall as well. But my question is, do y'all think I should put two over here? So two on this wall and one on this wall. I'm all about symmetry. So if I want to put one on this wall, then I also want to put one on this wall. Of course, I will also do a picture light here. I think it would look better if I do it landscape way because this wall has more space. But I'm not going to put this side portrait way and then this side landscape because that's just not going to match. And then also, me and Myron don't have any landscape pictures of us. So, let me know what y'all think. So, I'm going to do one, one picture and a picture light over here. But let me know if y'all think I should do one picture and a picture light here or two pictures, one picture light. Let me know. What's y'all thoughts? So it's pretty dark y'all i do apologize about that um oh my god it's dark hold on i look like it's gonna lighten up <laughs> um but my outfit is casual af i am wearing a target top she in pants and some nike roshis i don't even know what these are called they so old but they pink okay and they super comfortable we are going to a carnival, so comfort was my most important thing. You got a sad puppy who don't want his mommy to leave. But you got your food over there, you got your water over there, okay? You gonna be good? Be good for mommy? Okay, mommy. Y'all, when I tell you the rodeo is so freaking packed today, it's ridiculous. It's crazy um i've been here since 5 38 5 37 whatever and it's 606 and i'm just now getting to a parking lot so i went to the parking lot that me and taloya went to yesterday trying to park there but they wouldn't let me they said the parking lot was full so now i found this parking lot that's 25 dollars uh my friends are already here so i gotta park then meet them so we can get everything handled. It's 6 o'clock. I got a phone call at 7.30. So we're going to see what we can get done. Hello. All right. Okay, thank you. Um, $25 for parking, which is what we paid Tuesday. I guess they lean everybody a certain way. Yeah, they are.
but a day be Fucking up a check, I don't wanna receive Mind keep possessed, let my spirit speak freely Hey, my past can't escape me My pussy precedes me Why my how the time change I'm still playing the victim and you still play Hey y'all, I want to get out here and talk to y'all about yesterday before Leilani gets up here Clearly my face is doing something that I don't know what's going on because what is this so yesterday we went to the carnival we had fun y'all I did I did film a gender reveal for two of my friends I'm happy I don't know how much content I can put in the vlog because this vlog is going up on Saturday so I'm gonna have to chop some stuff out and then put it in the Tuesday vlog but either way y'all will get the content okay so as y'all can see i had a very busy day yesterday so i had to do the gender reveal i also had a group call to talk about this trip that we're doing in october so i had to sit down somewhere at the fair to discuss that it went well it went pretty well you know of course my background was loud but we got it done also um as I was walking back to find my friends, somebody asked me to watch their child. And I'm just like, do I give off auntie vibes? I feel like I do. I give off auntie vibes. I also give off good spirit because, yeah, I'm a good girl in real life. <laughs> uh, somebody asked me to watch their kids while they took pictures. And I'm just like, I love us. Black people going to stick together. Of course I said yes. <laughs> the little girl was good. She didn't say anything. She was playing on her iPad. So, yeah. Um, tonight I'm thinking about buying some last minute tickets to a comedy show. I'll keep y'all posted. I'm more than likely going to end the vlog, uh, right now. And then I'll start a weekend vlog. So, I don't know. I'll keep y'all posted. Uh, we also are about to get into this closet again for the second time this week my girl is about to come downstairs right now and help me out um i think what she's doing is she's pulling stuff out and folding it up, folding it up for me today so she shouldn't be here too too long but nevertheless i'm happy to get it done i need to go downstairs y'all there's a leak in my ac so child that is a story for another day okay but yeah, we are going to go ahead and end off this vlog right here. Thank y'all so much for watching. I hope y'all got enough content from Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and a little bit of today. So yeah, make sure you meet me in the comments, like this video, share it with a friend, and meet me in the next video, y'all. Bye.